Hi guys, happy Friday. So <laughs> I have this massive order that just came in. I closed a party, I am a Sensi consultant, so I did close a party um, and got some rewards and I wanted to share this with you. So, and I also have, I did, uh, before I bring back my bar ended, I did place a uh, order and I also got my Sensi club. So we're gonna do that all in one because I don't do a lot of Sensi videos. Um, just because sometimes I get big orders like this and then sometimes it's just my club order. I do have another party to close, so I'm trying to go through what items I need or want. Um, plus, I just ordered from their flash sale that is, ends tomorrow if I post this video on Friday, which is Friday. So there are still a ton of items left, but I bought warmers. <laughs> For gifts, warmers. Uh, so I just got a couple different things. And um, so I spent some money on that. <laughs> so yeah, so let's get into this box. Now I did take all the paper out because it was packed very well. So what I think I'm gonna do in this is I am going to show you the warmers and then I will see if I undo them and show them all to you so the first mini warmer I got was take me home I will show you the warmer though so it says take or love lives here and so I will show you it plugged in and the dish is a good size like that's really nice and it's open some I have some warmers like the enchanted pumpkin mini warmer and like to get wax into it is really hard so I'm I was watching videos before I bought this because I wanted to see how to get into the dish. So I was like, if this is hard to get into, I don't want it because it's not gonna work well in that space. So that is really cute. I Like I said, I get better performance with the ceramic. So that one is gonna be changed out. as soon as this video is done. <laughs> so I probably will just insert that video from his bathroom. So there, oh, there's that one. And I do keep the boxes, cause like if I, for my holiday ones especially, then I just save the box in my attic here and then I can put it back. So there's that one. This is my polar panorama dish. I shared in my video that my son broke this. He was messing around with my warmers, so I'm super happy to have this because then now I'm gonna put this in my on my mantel in my living room, so I'm happy to have that now. He did have to pay for that because he broke it because he was messing around and carrying my warmer. I Don't ask me why. Okay, I got 20 watt bulbs. I always think this is important to have because I have a lot of friends that are local that order from me and then sometimes they'll call me and be like, or text me, they sh let's be real, they text me. So they'll ask me if I have an extra bulb on hand and I do. And then I was almost out of the 15s. So I got that. All right, I got breakfast in bed room spray. I absolutely love, love this scent. So I don't even know if they put scent notes on this. No, gosh, why is it so difficult to put scent notes on? Is it maple? I don't know what, pumpkin and something else. Like, but this is a favorite scent of mine. Absolutely favorite. And okay, I just, okay, I know I just said this, but <laughs> I don't like glass warmers. But this is crowned in gold. And I got it because, <laughs> I'm a sucker because I saw videos on Instagram because I always go on Instagram and hashtag Scentsy Warmers and then I search under recent so I can see. I don't want to see the top ones because those could be older warmers. Oh my gosh, if I can get this open. Like not having nails is no fun. So I was searching that looking for some warmers. Like I like to see them lit up and all that kind of stuff. So I, I told you guys I want to redo... Oh my gosh, this is so much prettier in person. Oh my gosh. So I want to redo my master bathroom. I'm thinking 
a light gray and then accent it with this kind of blue and kind of the blue that I'm wearing with darker grays and white. So when I saw this and how, and again, I will insert a video. When I saw how beautiful this was, I was like, okay, I, I'm using my Sensi Rewards, so I'm gonna get it. So the other reason I got this is because, so in my bathroom, I have another warmer that's a two-in-one and it's a hot plate. So it really performs very well in there. I wanted this more for the ambiance. So again, I'll post a video in here. And I'm sorry, but this is gorgeous. Oh, doesn't that? And they have one with the like the pebbles on it, the teal one with pebbles. And I went back and forth between these two. But when I saw the ambiance lighting in this, from this, I was like, yep, I need that one, please. So there's that. Let's just continue with the warmers because I just have two more of large warmers, summer rain. As soon as I saw this in the catalog, I think some people got it, were able to purchase it beforehand. I was, I mean, I already knew I wanted this. This is just, if you saw my warmer tour, I love like the glass uh, warmers. For ambiance, they do not throw the best, generally for me. So this looks like rain, okay? So and then it has a cutout, so you can put your cord there so it sits flat. But this literally, it is textured on the outside. But And then you can see, well, you can't probably see, but on the inside, it's got this yellow, orange, pink hue. So when I've seen pictures of this and then different color bulbs, do, this is just, this is my jam. This is a 25 watt. So that is the other reason I was okay getting it because at least it wasn't a 20. I wanted to get the flower, the gray floral one, but I think that's only a 20 watt and it's small, I heard. So I, you'll see the other warmer I got instead. Oh my gosh. And how I absolutely love when they do the colored dishes. <coughs> So this one I'm actually going to be able to plug in for you because I think this is going to go in my living room and I'm going to take out, I'm going to take, put away my snowflake one this weekend because, so if I get a video and figure out where I want it, I will post a video, but I am going to plug this one in because obviously it has a two prong and I have my extension cord right here so I can do this. So let's plug that in. This literally looks like a sunset. Okay, let me just turn the light off. And you can see all my windows on here. But it is orange and pink. That is, that is gorgeous, wow. I honestly think I like the pink better, so I'm gonna have to try out some bulbs. If you have this, what bulb makes it like what bulb is your favorite? Should I leave it plugged in and put it back here? How about we do that? I should show you that Sensi has on here, the max is four cubes. If you didn't know what that four in here is, it's right here. Imprinted the four. I only usually use one or two cubes. My last one is the pressed tin warmer. So again, this should be ceramic. My, oh, should I turn my light back on? Like it really makes a big difference. But this isn't a new warmer, but I've had my eye on this and I just keep going back and forth and I'm like, I just, again, when I go on Instagram and I see the pictures, that's kind of what sways me. Cause I want to see it in real life. Now this one is a 25 watt as well. It's more of a cream. Okay, so let's get the dish. This is so pretty. I, I, and I like the soft bottom here. And, and it does say here, if you ever wanna know, it's a 25 watt, it'll say on the bottom here. So this one is not gonna emit a lot of light. It's just coming in from these spaces. And I'm okay with that. I wanted something to go on the counter um, in my kitchen. I, I took out a couple warmers that were holiday. So I, I really wanted it for that space. And I just thought, I've just seen so many pictures I mean, you can see how tall it is here. It's from the crease in my hand here. But this is so pretty. I'm super excited for this as well. 
I wish I had like more space, but I really don't want to move my candle. So how about we set it like that? <laughs> and we'll move it there. So you can hopefully see it. Okay, now let's get into the other stuff I got. All right. Okay, so here's the inside box. Okay, I got some scent circles, breakfast in bed, make a splash, and apple butter frosting. I will say I've had great luck with breakfast in bed, vanilla mint, but I have right now caramel apple craze in there. And like the first day it was perfect. And then like now it does not smell good. And it's been there like a week. So really disappointing, but whatever. I got a few more catalogs in here. No, nope. whatever. And then I had realized I forgot to order the little a couple of these because I usually order them just separate. I don't get the full transition kit because I already have like most of those. I mean, the only 10 new scents are the ones I needed. So I did get the ones that I forgot to add because I clearly wasn't paying attention when I ordered that. Okay, so then I got some dog detangling spray. I have the shampoo and the deodorizer, but I didn't have the detangling, so I wanna try this with my toy poodles. They obviously have very curly hair, um, and I wanted to see if this even helps. So this is honey and chamomile. This is my favorite one I get. I love their dog products. I got two washer whiffs, one in Palm Beach Breeze. I really enjoy the scent, and I actually have it in this, um, oh, so good the soap and then the Scentsy Soft. So I thought, well, I'm gonna, I ran out of that. So I'm like, I need to restock that. Then this one was on sale and Patricia here on YouTube talks about Fiji flower all the time. So I was like, okay, I'm not normally a flower person. This is really good. I can see why she likes this. I may have gotten more in the sale cause I got these on sale for like seven bucks. But then I think in the blowout, they were like 420. So I ordered more. Okay, I do love their bathroom cleaner. I will praise this. I sprayed this and let this sit for like 10 minutes and then I went in and hardcore scrubbed it and this works great. Every time I'm like, no, I'm not gonna order it. It's not anything great. But A, I love the smell when I'm cleaning and scrubbing. And B, it stinking works. So I'm gonna buy it. So I got the three pack. That was, I'm sorry if I didn't tell you, that was Coastal Sunset. Cloudberry Dreams. My last one was Make a Splash. Oh, look at the graphics on that too. My kids really enjoy using it as well. So, and they like the scent of it. So I, it just works for me in my house. Okay. Then I got some wax, of course. So I only got one Disney bar. This is Dumbo. This just came back. Everyone says this is the best. It's like a peach scent so i was like okay i don't know i've smelt this before i wasn't the biggest lover of it but i was like everybody continues to rave about it so i thought okay i'm gonna put this i'm gonna grab a bar i'm gonna warm this i think tonight in my bedroom bath and see what i think um so i'm gonna try this it definitely is peachy like a sweet peach definitely can see like a chewy peach gummy from this so let's see how it warms because to me that doesn't seem like a very tantalizing scent but whatever Okay, I got a few that were in clearance that I love, and I'm like, they're not in my club. So I'm like, okay, if you have three bars of this with my wax collection, it's gonna take me forever to get through this. This is Midnight, Midnight Fig. I love fig scents. I'm not gonna tell you scent notes because Scentsy doesn't put them, and if they're not gonna put them, so be it. But this is a beautiful fig scent. And then Wasail Wonderland, I absolutely love this. I think I have like four bars of this. This smells like a chocolate orange. I'm generally not an orange person, but this, or like a citrus person, but this reminds me of chocolate and orange candy that you get at Christmas time. I absolutely love this. I think I got like two or three more in the blow sale as well. So I was happy to snag a few more of those. And then I got a three pack. I got lemon sorbet. I'm not a fan of this. This to me still smells like lemon cleaner. It's not supposed to, but I don't know. 
I'll warm it and see what I think. To me, it's just not my favorite on cold, but things change on cold, so I'm gonna warm it. This is pink rhubarb sugar, pink rhubarb sugar. I actually have rhubarb in my garden that I planted in two places because I love rhubarb crisp. Have you ever had rhubarb? Because some people really haven't, and that surprises me. I have an amazing recipe, and I've made strawberry rhubarb jam as well. So this, I don't know what the scent notes are, but definitely do, I do like this. I definitely get like a, like a baked rhubarb scent. I do like this. And I don't know if it was Patricia. I Patricia here on, if you don't know her, Patricia, I'm, I can't remember your last or how your channel's listed. Maybe I'll add that here. Um, I adore her. Uh, she's from Canada and she has, well, she talks a lot about her son, Drew. So I just, I don't know. I feel like I know her, okay? And so she does amazing Tester Tuesday. Just search Tester Tuesday. And she'll post like, so she'll review two different scents and she is like the greatest, at, like she remembers scent notes and she gives the best stories related to them and I just love watching. So I got this scent because of her. <laughs> I'm pretty sure she liked that one, I'm pretty sure. This one, I'm fairly certain this was her again. Cause I was like, I'm not gonna order Apple Teeny Splash. The scent notes didn't seem like I would like it. And I just, but she raved about it. She said on cold it wasn't like, she wasn't sure, so then, oh, I have to warm this because it's green week, so I'm gonna have to warm this tonight. So she was like, I don't know if I'm gonna like this. On cold, this is this is kind of my jam. It's kind of a yummy tart green apple, but is there caramel in this? I don't know, I like this on cold. So she raved about this after she warmed it, and so I was like, okay, I'm gonna get it. So I don't wanna, anytime, if I miss, if I don't remember, something from your channel 100%. I'm truly sorry, but I do believe she likes both of those. So I wanted to try them because she knows her stuff on Sensi. Okay, so I got the three Easter pack, okay? I got those. So this one is Blueberry Burst, and this honestly reminds me of Blueberry Rush quite a bit, but I'm not a big blueberry person, but honestly, I think I like this one more because it almost seems like it has a pie crust or some kind of note in it. So I'm actually excited about this one because it seems, what is wrong with me? I don't like blueberry scents, but here I am saying that again. What is, I don't know what's happening to me. I'm sorry. <laughs> this is lemon drizzle cake. <laughs> Another lemon scent, which I do like lemon. Oh. This has a floral note in it. If I remember right, it's lilac, but why does that smell weird with lemon? Oh. Really? Oh, okay. Well, that's interesting. Okay, who is warm this? Is, I am gonna warm this only because my husband now I know likes floral and I'm gonna see what he thinks. I don't, I don't know that I'm gonna have time to warm this this because it's it's Friday and I usually pour, post my warm uh, bask, my melting basket on Sundays. I don't know if I'll get to that. This is raspberry lollipop. I definitely get raspberry in this. What else is in this? I wish Scentsy, for the love of gosh. Put the scent notes on the inside. Yeah, and I know some people, again, oh, they don't, they say, well, why do you complain about wax, but then you, from Scentsy, that they don't put labels on and then you still buy it. Well, because it's not a deal breaker. You got to pick your battles, right? Okay, I can definitely smell raspberry. It's a, and then it's almost a very tart raspberry, but I do like it. On cold. Okay, that was that order. Okay, so that was everything from one party I closed. My packaging slip now I see is like on the bottom. And this is where it'll show you if anything's back ordered. Nothing was. I didn't foresee that it was, but I wanted to check. Okay, this was something I just ordered before the Bring Back My Bar ended. I ordered more scent circles. And this is disappointing, like I said, because I got two of Caramel Apple Craze. And another breakfast in bed. But like I said, I put this in my car this week. Oh, yeah, they're both caramel apple craze. I put this in my van this week, Monday when I, or Tuesday when I, no, let me rephrase that. When I went back to work on Wednesday, because I was sick Monday, Tuesday. And it was great that first day. And then now this, it's Friday and it just does not do anything for me. That's disappointing. Breakfast in bed does, but that doesn't. Okay, so I got two of pink haze. This is in my club. 
but I'm going to take it out at some point. This to me smells like a sweet cotton candy almost. I don't know what the scent notes are, but this was in the bring back my bar. And like I said, I wanted to get more because it was in this. Did they have them on sale or something? I think at the end, I can't remember. Cherry almond pie because I love this scent. So I'm warming this downstairs right now. I absolutely love that scent. Huckleberry sage. It's not my favorite, but I do like it upstairs here for my boys. And so I wanted one more, but it's not in my club. Now caramel apple craze in wax does perform well for me. It smells like a car literally just a caramel apple. And I thoroughly enjoy this. Like, I hope this comes back and I, like, this would be always a repurchase for me. I love that. I got another apple butter frosting. Since I took this out, I really hope they bring this back. I had never tried this because I thought, well, it's just basic apple, right? This literally smells like hot apple pie and buttercream frosting thrown on top of it. And I don't know if you've ever made a homemade apple pie with cinnamon and then you take it out of the oven and it's crackling and it's bubbling. And then if you, I don't generally throw buttercream frosting on mine. I put vanilla ice cream on mine when it's hot or warm. And then you warm this wax and you're like, oh my gosh, who's baking in the house? And that is the best apple scent in the whole world. This is fabulous. It is in my club and it's not going anywhere. Love that scent. So obsessed with it. Midnight Fig, I got more because I love this. Like I said, it's not in my club, but I wanted to have a few backups. And I did go through my wax and I added what I had and was like, oh good Lord. So my club is gonna be, you'll see my club, but it's gonna be knocked the heck down. Strawberry Rose was in there and back. And I was surprised because I didn't think this was current, but I got one because I do kind of enjoy that. Just breathe because my son likes that when he's not feeling well. And then I got, is it ambrosia and um, yes this honestly i took cherry limeade out of my club because to me that lime note gives me a really sour scent to my nose and i don't like it honestly i wish i would have had this in my club because after smelling this on cold i prefer this over the cherry limeade scent so that's me so that was just a random order that i added because like I said, I wanted to get those bars before they were completely gone. And then my club order, it's not really that impressive. Well, never mind. It, it kind of is. I lied. Okay. Oh, where did my... Oh. So when you have a Scentsy Club that's over $60, you get to pick a half price item. And normally I do like my Scentsy Whiffs, but because I had gotten those on sale, I didn't want to order more. So I got the all-purpose cleaner. Concentrate. So you do dilute this, it's make a splash. I love this scent so much because it's obviously more aquatic. Um, so I wanted this and like, look at the label. It's like all mermaids, right? Mer mermen, mer, mer females, whatever. Mer people, how about that? Um, so I, I love this and we use this in our, my pet cleaner. So if the dogs have an accident, I use this. So it, I love it in my pet cleaner. Okay, so I got that for half price. So my club, sweet plum pastry. Now I did do my count and I think I have eight or nine of these. And it, again, this is brand new and it's like sweaty. My other bars weren't like that. And then it's already like, so I wonder how long this has been sitting in the warehouse, right? So I don't know. I think I'm gonna honestly take this out of my club because I have a lot of bars and this usually from my what I've heard it comes back every couple of years there's no way that I'm gonna get through these 10 bars that I have in that time because I have so much wax so I honestly think that one's gonna come out midnight fig I already took it out you see I already just got two other bars so I have a total of three here and I think I have two or three in my collection so this will last me a while Bora Bora Blossom, I took this out because I have two more of these. My husband likes this. It's not a favorite favorite because it's floral, but I wanted to get it for him. Cherry Almond Pie, I don't have a lot of these. So this actually, I think I merged my monthly club. I did a one-time order for some things and then I merged them into my 
quarterly is it that every three months so now i have two in there so i will keep two in there for a while graham cracker crunch this is a peanut butter scent i do get peanut butter i love this one so much breakfast in bed again a favorite it won't ever come out unless it's actually in the catalog this is a powerhouse love this scent i love the scent circle it just it it's so it lasts so long in my car um caramel pear crisp i love pear scents but i have two of these and then this one i think i thought that's good enough for now and i have a lot of vendor wax that makes great pear that i have like two loaves in so i'm like dude i'm set for ever okay simply vanilla again because of patricia here on youtube um she raved about this and i kind of got it like nah, i'm not gonna like it because it's just basic vanilla this performs very very well in my open concept and even better in my bedroom bath this is a beautiful 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 vanilla i can see why she likes this this is a fancy vanilla that will stay in my club for right now because i only have two bars pink haze again I absolutely love this. This isn't going anywhere. Now I see what the hype is. Strawberry swirl. It won't leave my club, you guys. This is, again, I don't know. This is a strawberry. And like my dogs are barking because the neighbors are walking with their dog. So I'm sorry. This is a strawberry. This smells like a strawberry milkshake. Oh, look at this. My nails, I mean, my nails are more coral, but. And then my last one is toasted marshmallow. Now again, I did my bar count and I think I have like six of these and I haven't warmed a bar in months. I absolutely love, this is like marshmallow fireside. I absolutely love this, but I think it's gonna come out of my club before it ships in June because I just have enough and I have I prefer this in blends. I'm super happy to have it, but unless I start warming this a lot this spring and summer, I'm gonna take it out. So this is a larger one because I wanted to get some of those bring back my bars and then I took them out of my club and I butchered my club. I think it's like $60 now. So it's quite, quite less because once you get all these, like I said, I mean, I have a lot of wax, right? And then add Sensi. If you guys saw in the sale that they started yesterday, I was at work obviously at noon. I was busy with, I had a lot of kids in my office sick and like it was a mess yesterday. Well, when I went on at 1247, I realized, oh my gosh, it's the flash sale. And I went on and they had cotton candy cookie. I just about cried because I, I was adding like 10 bars to my cart. And then I went to check out and it was like out of stock. It let me add it, but then it wouldn't let me check out. So then I went back and refreshed. And then I'm like, okay, well, it's still showing add to cart. So then I went deleted all the ones in my cart, I added more, and then every time I went to check out, it said it was gone. So I thought, well, maybe it's like shuffling with their inventory. I literally wanted to be so sad, because A, it was like $3.60 on sale, and then I, I literally have four left, and I could go through that in like a couple days. But I'm being dramatic, clearly, because I have way too much wax. But if you got it, score for you. <laughs> And you'll see when I get that order in, I clearly got enough, but I honestly did buy a lot of gifts. My daughter's birthday is coming up in a month. My um, son's birthday is in May. And then for secretary's day is April 26th and I have four secretaries. So I was like, I'm buying some of these mini warmers for six and $8 because I think with a, a bar of wax and a nice card and maybe some bath salts, like, and I bought, I bought the Scentsy Silk. I bought some scent circle. Oh my gosh. I Yeah. Anyway, happy Friday. We made it. Ah, it's Friday. It's my Friday. I hope it's your Friday. Um, I am off for spring break next week. I'm so excited. I do have one, two, I think I have like three hauls to record. I do. I'm going to de-stash next week. I have a massive de-stash over there. That is my goal next week. I will also want to send out, send out some random act of kindness things. So next week we don't really have any plans. So like we're not leaving to Florida, which I'm super sad about, but that's okay. I'm going to Florida in May with my friend and then my family and I will go in October. So um, I just want to say, I hope you made it through your week. Okay. I hope you have a wonderful, beautiful, blessed day. Bye.